So the alphabet is largely the same um, as English. There's a few distinct characters. So there's um, an S with a, call it a bird over the top, and then a C with the bird, and then a Z with the bird. Um, and so that makes the sound with like an H at the end. So the C, C bird would be ch, um, S bird would be sh, and then the Z bird is probably the strangest um, consonant sound for for English speakers. It's a zh, um, and, but uh, as far as consonants go, things are mostly the same. Um, and then vowels, they can do a few different things to the vowels that will adjust the sound. Um, sometimes, like there's an E with a dot above it, um, or a U with a bar above, and then A's, I's, E's, and U's can all have a, a nosina, which is just like a tail at the bottom. Um, and so all of those slightly adjust the sound. Um, it takes a while to be able to hear the difference. Um, and sometimes you still, like, you feel like you're saying it differently, but for a native, they would be like, no, 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 like you're still saying it this way or that way. Um, one of the, the positives about Lithuanian is that the alphabet is entirely phonetic. Um, so once you learn the sound that a letter makes, um, and once you know all the sounds, then you can read um, fine. You might not understand what you're reading, but you'll be able to pronounce the words correctly. Um, you'll have to learn some of the, the vowel combinations, which make slightly different sounds than you might expect by just saying them separately. Um, but for the most part, it's once you get the pronunciation down, um, then you can read and say things the way that they should be read and said, at least close enough that people will understand what you're saying. Labadiena, Manovarda Sira Connor, Ashish Americos, Ir no Dabar Studentas no Pergamo Yango Universiteta. Um, yeah, so I just said, um, good day, uh, my name is Connor, um, I'm a student at Brigham Young University. Um, yeah, um, and so, yeah, so that kind of gives a bit into what it sounds like.